A student recently asked me about my vision for education at the IU School of Medicine, and as part of that response, I told him that our work is ultimately about helping other people realize their dreams, like the dream of one student inspired to become a heart surgeon after his own cardiac surgery as a child, or the student who changed career paths from veterinary to human medicine after she participated in an overseas mission, or the student who chose to focus on rural medicine in order to meet the medical needs of his beloved hometown. As healthcare evolves, we are obligated to evolve, to better deliver on our tripartite mission and to help our students realize their dreams. And that's what reaccreditation and the CQI, the Continuous Quality Improvement Process, are all about, asking important questions and taking effective action to make our school better. We welcome this opportunity to enhance our students' education so they can better care for patients and be more adaptable and innovative as advances in medicine continue. Our work has already led to important enhancements and improvements. Our new curriculum is one example. In phase one of the revised curriculum, Transitions, help students begin to see themselves as healthcare professionals with coursework that integrates basic science with clinical experiences and gives them exposure to patients during their first year. Improvements are being made to both programs and facilities to increase the support provided to students. The mentoring and advising program connects students with faculty mentors at the start of medical school so they have a comprehensive view of career options and receive guidance on how to make and pursue those choices. The Teacher Learner Advocacy Committee, or TLAC, is taking an ombuds approach to facilitate receiving, exploring, and resolving issues that may arise between learners and faculty. These are just a few examples, and we look forward to others as we progress toward the April site visit. Through videos and letters, I will join our students, faculty, and leaders in sharing more about our pursuit of reaccreditation. Thank you for your support and commitment to this important work.